Well, Hannah, congratulations. Uh, how do you feel about the way it went today? Um, I have to be happy with gold, but I'm pretty disappointed in my total, um, but motivated to like get out and do more. Had you been lifting bigger weights in the lead up to this event? Uh, in training, yeah. Um, I had to cut a little bit of weight though for comp, so I guess I have to take that into account as well. And what about nerves? What were they like today? Uh, leading up to, I actually felt pretty good and then I woke up this morning and it like hit me that nationals was today. So I was definitely nervous, but I think a good amount of nerves. Sometimes some nerves and adrenaline are good. And what about um, where you go for the, the next few months and uh, your, your goals for the next 12 months or so? Um, I'd really like to qualify for the Commonwealth Games. That's kind of like my long-term goal. Um, I'm obviously not Australian, I'm Canadian. Um, so just in the works now, figuring out um, if I'm gonna stay in Australia, or if I'm gonna go live for Canada, or where I'm gonna go. So it's all in the works, but no solid answers as of now. What do we have to do here in Australia to convince you to stay in Australia? <laughs> Give me a visa! <laughs> <laughs> Is it that easy? Yeah. <laughs> You're obviously enjoying it here though. Yeah. Tell us how you, what brought you to Australia and what got you into weightlifting? Um, super random actually. I came to house sit for a friend of mine um, while she went on holidays for a couple months. Um, I crossfit back home so for about Oh, about 18 months or so I was crossfitting, came to house it um, for a friend of mine over here and got involved in a crossfit gym. Um, just kind of got on the platform more and more lifting weights. Um, and then kind of right after Christmas I was like, oh, I think I'd like to, I'd like to just do weightlifting for a bit um, and push my numbers. And I guess probably about six weeks into the cycle I was like, man, I really love this. I still miss like getting sweaty, doing crossfit and stuff, but my heart definitely lies on the platform, I noticed pretty quickly. So um, it's just kind of been since January that I've been like really gunning for, for nationals and to be on the platform like without doing anything else. You must have been inspired then by by Tia Claire Toomey, yeah, the Australian so weightlifter cool. from a CrossFit background who yeah. went to the Olympics. Yeah, exactly. And actually watching Tia in the um, like in the Olympics, she's so new to the sport. She's like just this amazing woman who's second fittest in the world and like on an Olympic stage, it was like pretty inspiring to look at and be like, man, that could be me one day. So it was really awesome to watch. Well, hopefully when it is you, you'll be wearing the green and gold, not the red and white. So. Uh, We'll get that working underway for the visa, but uh, well done, well done today. Congratulations! Thank You've got you the, so the gold medal around your neck, so be proud of that, and hopefully we'll see you a little bit more. Thank you so much.